All right, so time to give the E36 some love. Changing out the spark plugs. It's been like a year since I've done the plugs. And you guys saw in last video, very down on power. So I'm thinking it's probably the spark plugs. I'm gonna just change them out. Hopefully it'll wake the car up a little bit. This also might be an issue. This intake is literally right into the radiator. So I think it's getting heat soaked probably. So I might have to get a smaller intake. But yeah, I just wanna see what it does with the spark plugs. It doesn't hurt to change them. Oh yeah, they've seen better days for sure. So initially I was running these NGK four prong spark plugs. I'm gonna try these Bosch ones out that I got from FCP Euro. These are also a four prong. I just find that this car likes the four prong. That's what it comes with factory. These look really nice. These are platinum Bosch. I think these are gonna be great. The sweet thing with ordering them off FCP Euro is we got lifetime warranty. Even though these are a maintenance item, I will never have to buy spark plugs for this car again. Yeah, it definitely was not a bad idea to change these things. They are not looking too hot. All right, I guess we might as well do a little fluid check because we might get a little bit rowdy today. I'm not planning on going too insane, but you know, it might rain later, so. This is how this car keeps going, guys. I always check fluids. Never hurts to check fluids. That is how you keep your car running and driving. Gotta love it, dude. E36 thing, I swear. <laughs> no, but on the real, Ever since I put these new front tires on, well, new front tires, it's been doing this shake. I've already checked everything suspension-wise and it all seems pretty good. I think there's just like a little bubble on one of the tires, but it'll be all right. All right, so change of plans. It's looking really dead right now. I don't know if that's because I haven't like door dashed or Uber Eats in a minute, but yeah, it's super dead. We're gonna hit the junkyard real quick. I need some spare parts for this thing. The yard just got a new 328 in there, so I'm gonna grab some parts off that, and then we're gonna start doing some deliveries. All right, let's go get some parts. Ayo, got the limo out here. Uh-oh, I see the hood up on it. It's definitely been messed with. I hope the math's still there. Please be there. I don't think it's gonna be there. Oh, that sucks. Math is not there. That's one thing I really wanted. Please tell me the... Okay, the gas tank thing is still there. That's good, that's what we need, the sending unit. It's very nasty in here, wow. Ew. Axles are there. I'm gonna grab the axles. Let's see, is the back half of the drive shaft here? Exhaust is already out of the way, that's good. I think the drive shaft's still here because the uh, heat shield's still on. Okay, so at least we can get most of the parts. For the math, I'm gonna probably have to just get that new. Get these wheels off. Wow, of course they're seized on there. You can tell already this thing's gonna be fun to work on. Dude, talk about rust. Be free. Oh wow, this is a lot easier than it usually would be. I like I'm gonna get malaria in here. All right, so sending unit, check. Wow, super clean. Might as well eat this. All right, so we got that score. Now, let's see if the axles come off. <laughs> Initially, let's see if they're seized. Most of the time they're seized in the hub and you can't even get them out, so there's no point in doing all the work. Let's see. This one's looking a little rough. 
Let's see if maybe we can just eat it with this. All right, so like I suspected, axles are completely seized in there, both sides. So that's not gonna come out, oh well. But yeah, I'm gonna get the rear side of the drive shaft out. So, I gotta find like a seat, maybe this thing has seats. There we go. Make sure this thing is secure. Come on. There we go. Working on cars is so much fun. I'd say it was a pretty successful junkyard run. Got this side skirt from Matthew because he kind of totaled his. It is currently 3.54 p.m. So just gonna get all the uh, the dinner rush, I guess. I think today is gonna be pretty busy because it's a Thursday, first off. I mean, Thursdays usually do pretty decent. I haven't done DoorDash Uber Eats for a minute, so we will see. Maybe they like took me off like priority or something for delivery driver, but it also is raining. It being raining, I think a lot of people are gonna wanna just stay home and get the food delivered to them. Oh yeah, it says it's very busy, so. We're gonna start dashing and, oh wow, we already have an order. <laughs> I didn't even mean to accept it, but we already got an order to Panera, so let's go, dude. <laughs> Just now started and we already got orders, so like I predicted, it's pretty packed. Let's get it, dude, this is gonna be fun. Got some meh tires on. Oh yeah, these tires have literally no grip. <laughs> but I know a bunch of you guys have wanted me to make some of these videos again. So I decided I would make one today. I kind of took a break from this for a minute because it was giving me some like ear issues. I was getting some like tinnitus symptoms. I think it's because of my no windows, but yeah, I don't know. I'd hear like some like weird heart type, like a heartbeat in my ear constantly and it was really, really annoying. So I kind of just took a break from this for a while to see if that was the issue or something. And it ended up being the issue. So yeah, after a couple months of just not doing that it went away thankfully yeah that was definitely a scare i don't know how a lot of people with health issues deal with that on a day-to-day -day basis it was really annoying hearing that in my ear constantly and i was going insane but yeah thankfully i'm not really having those symptoms anymore but if you are dealing with a health issue from day to day best of luck because i know that can really bring you down for me i don't know i just as hard as it was to like ignore it i just kind of just tried to ignore it and make it my but it was definitely not easy, I can tell you that. But I'm really, really happy that my ears are chilling now. Or so I think. I mean, maybe if I start doing this again, it'll come back, but who knows, man, who knows? Let's just go pick up this order and make some money and have some fun. Hey, yo, I see you with the Urus. Hell yeah. Just weld to death things pulling into the parking spot. <laughs> All right, time to go get wet. <laughs> Shout out Yoshi. Let's go play some Mario Kart. Old girl is herded from this weekend. <laughs> ah, we're getting wet. Ah, <laughs> no. I think if we keep the food in the bag right here, it'll be chilling. Kind of impossible to keep it from getting wet though. Like just walking out here, I got soaked. The bag got a little bit wet. Not gonna lie, but I think the food is chilling. Sorry, Yoshi. All right, we got another order that's literally going to the exact same spot. So we picked it up. This is from DoorDash, but might as well do two at once. All right, got the other order. Got their, looks like boba, kind of. I don't know, that's a weird drink. Traffic is ridiculous right now. I'm not feeling this traffic. Very good, school bus, go. These tires 
are perfect though. They're, they're not like washing out to where I'm getting hydroplaned every five seconds, but they're still loose. They got like no grip though. Oh, I wanted to spin third, but dude, I should have brought my squeegee. Damn, that is one thing I'm missing. So hopefully if I like have another order close to my house, I'll have to grab the squeegee because I am not gonna be able to see. They're actually going to the exact same address. <laughs> One's a DoorDash, one's an Uber Eats. I was so awkward. They were all having like a meeting or something and I like walked in twice. They were like, why is this guy in here twice? <laughs> Bro, it is so busy right now. I literally just got another order like as soon as I left. This one's an alcohol order. I gotta, or I gotta find the, okay, at least it's all for the same bottle. Nah, we're not doing that one either. Dude, they are just lighting my phone up right now. This is great. So I gotta shop and I gotta grab these like four bottles of wine. Dude, I literally cannot see anything. Ah! I got tire on my hands now. This steering wheel is tire grimy too. We gotta grab four La Bella Sparkling Rosé. That was easy. shopping pays again. I don't know why I'm getting those today. I usually never get those, but whatever. A couple of you OGs know that I used to do Instacart, so pretty decent at shopping now at this point. I saw there was seven items, so I should be able to get in there, get out, and make a quick 14, 15 bucks. I don't remember what it was, but not bad. Less driving, the better. As much as I do love driving, lately is just up there you know luckily this thing's weight reducted so we get that max mpg today's been a good day so far dude it hasn't even been an hour yet we're at twenty dollars 75 cents on doordash and uber eats i will not be able to tell pretty sure we're like 15 or something on uber eats so not bad dude what is that 35 for an hour i know take off gas or whatever but i really haven't used that much in gas i've maybe driven like eight miles, so not too bad. I've never been in this one Dixie before. Oh. Gotta make sure to peep the dates. This one's gonna last the longest. Oh, I thought we almost didn't have that. All right, now we just got these bubbly waters and we're good. Let's see where they at, right here. Chilling. We got what, grapefruit, blackberry. Where the grapefruit be? Oh, right here. And blackberries right here. Sick. We good. This cart, <laughs> a little small for this, but we good. This is probably the slickest spot in town right here. This four way. We're not gonna catch any grip till we hit the top of the bridge. finally being able to see again but hopefully it doesn't dry up because this is so much fun kind of just like skid around not make a bunch of noise to where everyone thinks that like something crazy is happening no one's gonna like call the cops on me just doing a little slide so i like this this is good this is perfect i can see and we can do skids all right so we just got another uber eats it's a double order so a little bit better pay. 
not too far either. So it's exactly what we want, dude. We're gonna make some decent money today, I think. It's literally a win-win. Like, I don't mind doing this. It's pretty fun. And it's content. The only thing is, is who knows if my ear just starts messing up again, but that's life. Bro, I am thirsty. I need my Wawa ice water, bro. It's not here. Something's missing. Just got the first order. <laughs> Bro, that drive shaft in the rear is about to let go, I swear. <laughs> There's so much play in it now, and I can feel it like vibrating. Not good, but I have a spare, so we're good. Might as well break this one. Damn, this homeless guy is always here. Hey, man. I, it's not much, but I hope you can he can help you out, man. Have a good one. Damn, I see him there like literally every day. Really sad to see people like that, dude. Well, I'm an idiot. I uh, accidentally uh, <laughs> said I delivered the other order. Now I'm on like this automated system thing. Damn. <sighs> Damn, I messed up. Look at this. I have this order. <laughs> Can't complete it because now I'm on the phone right now. <sighs> Shake my head, man. Wasting time. Idiot. All right, so I guess the guy did not answer, and I get free food now. I want to see what the food is, honestly, first off. And maybe I'll grow up. I think it should be good. Yeah, we got another order, so it's like 20 bucks for less than three miles. So I'm very hyped about that. Sometimes bad things lead to good things. All right, so we're just kind of waiting for this order for a minute. So might as well start digging into the food. I don't know what this is, but it looks like some some sort of dessert or something. I don't know. It smells pretty desserty. So I'm gonna try it. It's like a pastry. Give it a try with my nasty hands. pretty good kind of like cinnamony I don't know that's weird what is this yo pita bread this is definitely gonna slap right now bro this this be slapping this right here I needed some of this this is good all right now that, that was good I'll give that a solid I'd say 7 out of 10. Not bad. If only it was a little bit warmer. I've been sitting here for a minute, so definitely kind of cooled down. We got one more thing. Let's see what we got. It's a mystery, mystery meal. Oh, some french fries. Dude, this looks so bussin'. I really feel bad for whoever didn't get their food, but this is what Uber Eats told me to do. So, I said dispose of it safely. I'm being pretty safe eating this right now. So. Mm. All right, so I guess they had like some issues with their technology or whatever, and they never saw the order. So they said it's gonna be like 15, 20 minutes. So. Hopefully, I can pick up this other order, but E36 gang, I don't know if you guys can see that. Red E36 vert. Verts suck though, don't get a vert. But yeah, we're gonna go get the other order, which is right here at Applebee's. Luckily it was right by, and hopefully the first delivery is delivering this order. So yeah, let's see. So much for an easy $20 order that's close. I had to talk to the first customer to tell them that I had to deliver this other order. I had to like save their address. I have to deliver this other order because I didn't want the other order to just sit there and get cold. 
because out back their system was whacked out or something but yeah they told me it was like 10 15 minutes for them to make their food so i was like damn i gotta deliver this other order so it doesn't get cold but yeah we got that figured out i called them they were thinking that i was like trying to like scam them or something it's just been crazy yeah now we're about to go pick up the outback order and hopefully we can deliver that order with ease and we can just be back to normal and good to go and maybe i can finish eating that food because that food was delicious i need to refuel too i think we'll have enough just to get to them oh man imagine if i run out of fuel on the way to <laughs> bruh that would be horrible i thought it was going to be a simple 20 dollars order you know three miles away no biggie but it's just turned into a complete show this is right after that other show too that was my fault for some reason my phone gets like water on it it just starts clicking a bunch of random things and i just like said it was delivered when i didn't even deliver it yet so i couldn't see their address <laughs> all right let's see if they're mad Hi, Joseph. Sorry about that, man. You're fine, man. Okay. It is fresh for you. The margarita's in there. I Be appreciate careful. it. Thank you, sir. Have a good night, man. Of course. Hey, have a good night, man. Enjoy. Hell yeah, that went well. All right, we're good. Phone's about to die. Car's out of gas. Let's just get some more orders. <laughs> Bro, today is absolutely cursed. All the gas pumps. Just not not working we got no gas oh boy hopefully i can make it to the other gas station ah! why this doesn't help i know my car bro all right she's fueled up for the most part the 30 30 or 3 in her Let's go get more deliveries, please. Oh, I hate McDonald's though, dude. Picking it up from there. Oh man, this is looking very, very, very fun. Oh man. Hopefully I can just curbside pick up in it. I wanna see if I can go inside, maybe. I doubt they're gonna be open though. Typical McDonald's after pandemic. Oh. He just, okay, is that, is that door locked? No, I don't think the door's locked. All right, let's get it. All right, we got the order. I honestly highly recommend not going to McDonald's if you're doing Uber Eats or DoorDash. Not a move, it always takes forever. Everything is like way too overdeveloped here now. So like it's, it's a lot harder to street drift now. Within like the last year, everything just got built over so quickly. All right, another order down. This looks like it could be kind of fun. So we're just gonna send it.
pretty sick though, honestly. It's not much, but it's honest work. See what I can do for a layout though. This wheel is there's something grabbing this wheel though. It's making it like extra stiff. You can literally hear it squeaking. I don't know what the hell that is. I'll catch you all in the next one. Thanks for watching.